hey everybody thank you for joining me for another video so in this video i will be showing y'all how i am going to blow out my hair today this tool i had for a long time but i'm going to show y'all how i use it and i think you guys will like it so go ahead and keep on watching All right, everybody, so for this video, you'll need the obvious a blow dryer. This is the Conair Infinity Pro blow dryer that I ordered about almost a year ago, actually about six months ago, actually. And then you'll need the tool that I was referring to, which is a blow dryer venting brush. It's actually like a chasing chasing brush. Um, I ordered this off of Amazon a long time ago. I think it's called a T25. I don't know, y'all, just look it up, look it up. Um, I really don't know the name of it. So anyhow, y'all, let's go ahead and get started. Now, I am starting this blowout on stretched hair. I already did the left side, so I'm about to do the right side. Um, even though my hair is stretched, I wanted it a little more stretched than what it is. So I just decided to try this tool to get a little more straightness to my hair without flat earning it. Now I have used this tool before to straighten, to actually flat iron my hair with the flat iron. I used it as the chase method and I really don't like it that way only because it tends to cause static when I'm flat ironing. I don't know why that is, but yeah. So anyhow, go ahead and get your heat protectant of choice and spray that on. I didn't want to spray too much because I didn't want it to be wet. I didn't want my hair to be wet. So anyhow, I'm going to go in without combing it, even though I have combs on the blow dryer. I'm just going to run it up and down my hair as you guys see me doing right here. Now, I ain't going to lie to y'all, this took way longer than what I wanted it to take. So my advice, if you are going to use this tool, and if you have a blow dryer with comb attachment, just go ahead and brush the comb attachment through your hair versus doing what I'm doing here. That will save you a whole lot of time, okay? Because this took way, way longer than what I thought it would. All right, you guys, so this is where I'm going to start using this tool. I'm going to go ahead and brush it through my hair. It is technically br a brush, <laughs> not a regular brush, but a brush nonetheless. Now, if y'all could see, I am using this for more tension on my hair, which will allow me to get it a lot more straighter than what it is now. Now, y'all can see how I'm running my blow dryer up and down or across the vented holes. Um... You can do that, but it would be a lot easier if, you know, you um, just held the blow dryer at the vents. And it also would be a lot better if you had a blow dryer like with the round uh, opening versus the one that I'm using because it will blow through the vents a lot more. But as y'all can see, my hair has gotten a lot straighter even with that one pass. Now I'm going to do it again. And again, you don't have to do it the way I'm doing it. You could just use it as tension and use the blow dryer on your actual hair or you could do it the way i'm doing it and actually make sure the heat is going through the vents of this brush which is what it is made for All right, so as y'all can see, I got very, very sleek results with this method. So I'm gonna go ahead and keep on doing this throughout my entire head. All right, so now that I have achieved the results I wanted, I'm gonna go ahead and split my hair into sections and put it in a twist so it can remain in a stretch state. Excuse that, y'all. <laughs> Don't wanna be showing y'all my cleavage. But anyhow, so I'm going ahead and twist it up and, you know, just make sure it stays in a stretch state because the bathroom was very very hot so yeah let's go ahead and keep it going so y'all might have noticed that my lighting has changed i had to pause the video and make some adjustments but anyhow y'all go ahead and um just make sure every section that you do is thoroughly detangled 
for best results i am not going to talk through this whole thing because i'm pretty sure by now y'all get how the process goes All right, so I wanted to come back in and show y'all the texture that is still in my hair. And that way y'all could definitely notice the difference that this method will make in the straightening or stretching process. As y'all can see, the texture is gone. Yay! Let's keep it moving, y'all. All right, y'all, so we are done. I went ahead and skipped the rest of my head showing that because I didn't feel it was necessary. Y'all got the point of how I did the process. So the results are amazing. Let's go ahead and see the final, final results. All right, so before I show y'all my hair down and combed out, I just wanted to show y'all I did plait it during the process so it wouldn't revert again I, the bathroom was like super hot so i didn't want to have this being a waste of time so yeah i'm about to take these down so y'all can see how good this turned out okay y'all this time this is the final final so i am loving 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 the results y'all it feels so good i had a lot of oil in my hair so i think that contributed to the feel but yeah y'all i loved it so much as y'all can see i colored my hair just obvious so uh, even the color brings it out even more the only reason why the texture is there is because again i braided it up so yeah but i'm going to comb out the texture so y'all can see how it looks you know with it combed out it's flowy it's light i did do myself a little trim um, because it was definitely needed Okay, y'all, so I'm getting ready to brush this out so y'all can see how it looks um, in its blown out state without it being braided. So yeah, here's me brushing it out. As y'all can see, it is a really nice blowout without using a whole bunch of heat. And I just wanted to point out too, the reason why I didn't use the combs on my blow dryer is because when it's in contact with the hair, it distributes way more heat. All right, y'all, so here it is. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments if you tried this out. Have a good day, y'all.